There's a lot of buzz about what's happening at Centennial Airport. Last year, the airport started transitioning to LED lights in an effort to be more sustainable and environmentally friendly. Well, one month ago, Centennial continued that mission by adding two beehives. Jamie Leary put on protective gear to check it out. So I'm wearing this giant bee suit as a precautionary measure, but fortunately for me, these gals are pretty calm and that's great news. It seems they're thriving in their new home right next to the Centennial Airport. It makes you look like a marshmallow, not like a bear. Not exactly common attire for an airport. Hopefully that'll keep you protected. Hopefully, but the Centennial Airport is thinking toward the future. And with tons of land it can't develop, we thought bees would be kind of a perfect match. This is Gina Connolly's pet project. Someone believed in me and I kept doing research and the hives are out here, so it means that I can do even more. She contracted one of the most dedicated beekeepers around to help. I don't get bored at all. It's, you know, it's more of uh, a passion than uh, a burden. Jill Comparato doesn't care if there are two hives or 20. The bees are part of the environment, and we can't live without the bees. He marvels at all they are responsible for. The red peppers, the watermelon, the strawberries, the blueberries, raspberries, you could go on and on, even broccoli and cauliflower. With a wet spring, these bees have plenty of pollen. You see this bee with the yellow on her back? Yeah. Pollen baskets. That's pollen that they've brought in from somewhere out here in the fields. And the mesh face cover didn't get in the way of taking a sample of the nectar. Oh, that's very sweet. sweet. There are 60,000 bees here total. Relatively small, but it's just the beginning. Well, there's some old proverb that says you can't take a journey without taking the first step. And I look at this as the first step. The fact that these gals are doing so well out here means that more hives are likely in store for the Centennial Airport. At Centennial, Jamie Leary covering Colorado first.